Welcome. Today, we'll be discussing the triangle midpoint theorem. So let's consider this triangle on the left-hand side, where the blue point are the vertices of this triangle. And in addition to that, we got some green points. Now, what's so special about these green points is that they are located right in the middle of the line segment. So we can call them the midpoints for each of those segments. So what would happen if we start connecting midpoints? So let's start with a ruler and let's connect the midpoint D to the midpoint E. So here we have a line segment DE. Now, this line segment has a special relationship with the side that is opposite to it, which is AC. So let's highlight them. DE has a special relationship with the side that is opposite EC. And what is that relationship? Well, that relationship is that DE, it's parallel to its opposite side, which is AC. And in addition to that, also DE is half the length of its opposite side, which is AC. So what would happen if we decide to connect another two midpoints? Let's connect the midpoint F to the midpoint E. This midpoint FE has a special relationship with the side that is opposite to it. And that relationship is that FE is still parallel to AB. So let's put down a diagram. And in addition, FE, it is half the length of its opposite side, which is AB. And the same will still hold true if we connect the other two midpoints that we haven't connected, which in this case is DF. So let's connect them. If we connect these two midpoints, then that line segment that we have created, which in this case, DF, has a special relationship with its opposite side, which is BC. And that special relationship is that DF is parallel to BC. So let's put that on a diagram. And then in addition, DF is also half the length of BC. So in conclusion, anytime that we connect midpoints, there's going to be two properties that always occur. The first one is that it's going to be parallel to its opposite side. And second is that it's always going to be half the length of the opposite side. Hello, if you would like to continue to learn about mathematics, you can check out the videos on the left.